to shit. I boarded, uh, I hoarded all those filthy pigs up in a steel pen and set some C4. All I gotta do is detonate it and it's sayonara, suckers. But it's not no fun it's over too soon, so maybe I'll give them that raving loon something to really be upset about. Or, sorry, to really squeal about. <laughs> yeah, maybe I'll give him a little toy and we'll tell him Kill the guy next to you, or I'll spare, and I'll spare the others. I wonder what he'll do. You, yeah, you yelled at justice and pride, but how many times did you go against me, your own superior? Yeah, you're such a good cop. So good you had to die. Man, this is fun. I need some music for this. I wonder what kind of person wrote this note. Hmm. There's some pretty crazy people in this game, I suppose. Alright. So, note to myself, I have not picked up the key. <laughs> I need you back here ASAP. Are you okay, Marvin? I've got something to show you. Yeah. It's important. Marvin okay. wants us right to go there. back. So, this is the library. Uh, let's take a look around. thought for a second that was a flower. Uh, a green herb, it was just a flower. <laughs> I wanna see- there we go, that's what I wanted. Yeah. A throwback to the original when you would also fall through the uh, wooden floor uh, from the third- uh, third stairs. Third floor stairs! <laughs> Use your words, cat! And there we go. Defensive item. And I will actually take my knife now, thank you. So basically, once you use the defensive item, you can retreat it from the body, but as you can see, it will have taken some durability damage. Ah, look, the library! You can actually sit down now! If you guys remember the original library, there were no places to sit, so the cops would have to read standing up, I guess. is not going down. <laughs> okay. And then there's this one as well. Uh, another zombie that's kind of busy uh, having a nice snack over here. We're just gonna leave them to it. Uh, there is something here that I know a lot of people have been asking me about for the demo as well. You cannot really do anything with this currently. It is something Involving a future puzzle. Yeah, so the library is pretty cool. Um, oh, we can't actually... We, uh, right, right, right. We, we have to go... If we're gonna go back to the main hallway, we have to go all the way around. So I can either grab the key and just not go downstairs, or I could just go all the way back around. Uh, yeah, so regarding the difficulties, thank you for reminding me, that's a good question. Um, there will be the default setting, obviously, for, for first-time players and newcomers to the series. Uh, I am currently playing on normal mode. But there will also be a more traditional experience available to the hardcore fans who want um, limited saves and other things like that. Uh, we will probably tell you more about that in the future. Oh, I wanted to show you guys this as well. Uh, I know a lot of people have played this demo and at E3 and uh, Comic-Con and whatever, but have you guys ever reflected on this? What do you think that is? Let's hear chat. What does this look like? Doesn't exactly look like a standard archway, does it? That's not a door! Exactly! <laughs> there you go. Cool, Kool-Aid van. I love that. Kool-Aid van. Yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> um, let's take this, I guess. And you know what? If we... If I accidentally trigger the ending, 
we can just fire it up again. I also have to check what time it is, because today's stream is going to be a little bit short, you guys. We are just uh, testing the waters today. I'm just doing a test stream, trying to see how things will go. Um, if you guys would like to see more streams in the future, uh, definitely be sure to show support. Make sure to come out to the streams whenever you can. Make sure to follow uh, the Resident Evil channel. Uh, you can also follow our our brand pages, um, so Twitter, at RE Games, Facebook, Resident Evil Official, or Resident Evil Standard, I think it's called. Um, yeah. Uh, and yeah, YouTube.com slash Resident Evil. So there's many avenues you can follow us on. You can also follow my personal twi Twitter, if you care about that, at uh, I'm Catastrophe. I am the community manager, as I said, so I like to post a lot about Resident Evil, and um, hopefully in the coming months I'll be able to share some more exciting news with you guys. This is another puzzle. Uh, let's see if I remember the combination. Oh, someone said I missed a map. Uh, we will see, guys, if I can go back to it. I probably did miss it. There we go. Let's take a look at this. It is a lion metal. So in the original, if you guys remember, uh, the fountain downstairs had a slot for a unicorn metal. Now that's been changed around a little bit, and there are a few more medallions. Actually, I want to go back up here, because I just realized I forgot to show you guys this room as well. This is also a brand new room. Uh, another statue here, the unicorn statue. See, it, it was only a metal uh, in the original, and now it has been upgraded to a statue. <laughs> There's the map. If you guys are interested in taking a look at it. Uh, this room, by the way, is directly above the waiting room downstairs, so that's a little... That's a... Hi! <laughs> Really good to see you! Yeah, he's he's not gonna get up. This area is locked. So you'll have to wait till January 25th to see what's in here. Oh, exciting. Uh, I guess we could just go downstairs and try to wrap up the demo. Um, it's just a knife, you guys. It's not a big deal. Right. There we go. There you are. Come here. Take a look. Jess. I knew she'd make it. Oh, you know her? Yeah. Name's Claire. I came into town with her. You can get to that courtyard, through the second floor, east side. <laughs> I'm on it. Thanks, Lieutenant. Yeah, Marvin is definitely getting worse there. I guess we will have to see what his fate is like 